The weekend was such a cute kid. The Starboy singer took fans on a rare trip down memory lane this week, sharing a series of sentimental snapshots from his childhood on his Instagram story. In one, little Abel shot the camera a grin while on the move at home. Other pictures showed him hanging on the couch and posing for a family photo at the park. Abel left the adorable pics uncaptioned, letting them speak for themselves. But he did drop a red heart on this picture of a fun mother-son piggyback ride. The weekend has shared other glimpses at his early years in the past. Last June, he posted this cute look at him repping his hometown baseball team, the Toronto Blue Jays, as a toddler. And last Mother's Day, he paid tribute to his mama with this sweet throwback. It's crazy to think that less than three decades later, this little guy would be one of the biggest names in music. The weekend's sensational career hit another high note this week, when his smash song, Blinding Lights, made history as the first track to ever spend a full year in the top 10 of Billboard's Hot 100 chart. He chose the chart topper as his closing song for his Super Bowl halftime show last month, a performance that will not be soon forgotten. The spectacle featured dozens upon dozens of backup dancers matching his signature all-black ensemble and gloves, topped with a sparkling red blazer, and facial bandages that doubled as face masks. Days before the big performance, Access Hollywood's Zuri Hall talked to The Weeknd about his journey from childhood to the big game. She recalled that he dropped out of high school as a teen to make it on his own. And clearly that path led him to something great. What would you tell your 17 year old self who left home, moved into a small apartment with a friend, you know, eventually that young Abel was gonna become the Super Bowl halftime star. You've accomplished so much. What would you tell that kid? Um, don't quit. Mm. Just don't quit. Um, and there were times where, you know, it was, it was easy to quit, but yeah. I would tell him to just keep going. Do you think young Abel would believe you when you told him where you'd be today? I hope so. He was pretty hard-headed. Mm, a little stubborn. Okay. Uh, 